a good clue is if you say to if you find yourself saying oh i've always wanted to do that like notice yourself catch yourself saying that i've i've always wanted to go to sweden never been to scandinavia i've always wanted to sing well all right i, I just started working with a singing teacher because I'm sick of saying, oh, I've always wanted to do that. Always wanted to act, always wanted to, like, that's a good clue. I've always wanted to go see that play. I've always wanted, I know someone's telling you they did stand up and you're like, oh, I've always, I've always wanted to do that, but it's been too scary. I think that's, that's a good clue. And what if you went in that direction? You know, I've always wanted my business to make 50,000 or 100,000 a month instead of five or 10,000, what is it for you? Yeah, and, that, and that's crucial. I, I, and you mentioned stand-up, and I remember this was in this was the mid-90s. I was working for a CPA firm, and we went out uh, for a dinner and comedy uh, club event. And I don't remember who the main act was, but the opening act was this new comedian that was out on the chain called drew carey you know we've we've known what he's been he's been on television hosts the prices right now has had a pretty successful career and i don't remember anything that the main comedian said that night but i remember him and just the way he was interacting with the crowd kind of back and forth kind of thing which was amazing the other one was you know just kind of telling jokes and was engaging but not as much but you know drew was one of those people that just was you know, really good at it and i'm sure at some point you know he you know said to somebody and you know, when he grew up in cleveland or around that area where okay i'm thinking about doing this okay you know go to the comedy club go do this and he took that step and yeah and and that's the thing you, you never know you know and that's the thing you, you, your life could completely change forever on a path just because you finally say you know what i'm gonna hire that coach i'm gonna talk with those people i'm gonna figure out how to do this and there's nothing wrong if you do it and you realize okay you know what this is not for me great no not a neuroscientist but you know you do something new the the brain has to create new pathways my singing teacher just asked me if i wanted perform in a recital coming up in a month oh my god i've never other than karaoke i've never performed a song i've done it with a guitar which is different you know you singing along everyone sings along but actually singing that's going to be a whole new experience so i said yes all right i'll do it because it's new i joined a, a playback theater troupe a couple of months ago and the audience members tell a story from their life and then the troupe says let's watch and they reinterpret the story and bring out the deeper lessons hugely scary for me very right-brained might do a dream sequence and then improvise a song and recently they said all right you're going to perform with us this is your first performance and you are going to improvise all of the music for the show i have never improvised music before i know how to play piano and guitar but I've never improvised it but I said yes because it's a new experience so who knows what that's going to do for the brain that's where we want to look landmark education uh, they always said this is the people who did that course I originally did called the landmark forum they would say you don't know what you don't know now there's lots of things you know you don't know oh I, I know I don't know how to do brain surgery I don't know how to build a rocket I don't know how to generate electricity. Like a lot of things I know I don't know. But what about that massive area of life where you don't even know you don't know? That's where the Landmark Forum operates. And I think it's where the best coaching operates. That's the most exciting stuff for me. People come to me for things that they know they want. They know that they want more money, they want more time off, and they might hear something on a podcast like this and say, I could be more expressed. I could be more authentic. I could be more courageous. I could go for it more. So they know they come with that. But after a few months, other things start to emerge. Oh, I didn't know this was something I could work on. Oh, I didn't really think this was possible for me. I'd just given up on that. Or I'm just resigned to this and my relationship really we can make that better so that's exciting for me what you don't know you don't know